because of her distinguished academic performance, for using her natural leadership abilities to promote the well-being of the St. Vincent student body, for her continuous involvement as an SGA officer, for her desire to better the lives of those around her, whether it be in a tutoring session or assisting one of the residents, for the extraordinary ability to give of herself as evidenced by involvement in service projects on campus, in the local community as well as Guatemala, Nicaragua, Taiwan, China, for her continued commitment to the marginalized as demonstrated by her decision to join the Jesuit Volunteer Corps. And because she embraces the Catholic Benedictine liberal arts values of St. Vincent, it is my honor as president of St. Vincent College to confer upon Olivia Rose Sharkey. If there is anything that St. Vincent College is, it is indeed a community. Brother Norman, I thank you for this honor, but truthfully, this award is not solely mine to accept. My positive journey while at St. Vincent College was only made possible due to the many relationships that this community has afforded me over the past four years. Therefore, this award also belongs to the four other finalists and our entire senior class who have prompted me to further explore what it means to be a servant of the Lord. To the monastic community, which has so graciously extended itself to me in the genuine spirit of hospitality. And to the dedicated administrators, faculty, and staff of this college, especially the members of the theology department who have provided me with the opportunities to witness the manifestation of the Benedictine values, both here on this campus and beyond. Dr. Jack Opperly once mentioned in class that humans were created with minds to think, hearts to love, and hands to serve. I am beyond grateful to my parents who have blessed me with the opportunity to become a part of this St. Vincent community a community that has indeed cultivated within me a mind to think, a heart to love, and hands to serve. As the class of 2013 proceeds forward in the spirit of our founder, it is my prayer that we continue carry within us this understanding of our creative purpose, that we use our minds to think, our hearts to love, and our hands to serve in order to be true disciples of our living God. Thank you.